I'm with Altair Engineering. I'll be discussing how an engineer can approximate commercial antenna patterns with a workflow available in Altair Hyperworks. Engineers install antennas on various platforms. These antennas are often purchased from other vendors who naturally want to protect their intellectual property. As a result, they withhold their 3D models and instead supply customers with two principal plane cuts. Engineers must therefore interpolate between the two datasets with a workflow available in Altair Hyperworks. The process starts by digitizing data with one of two options. Engineers can either import numerical data or manually trace bitmap images. Once the data has been digitized, engineers can choose between five different interpolation algorithms, add polar metric data, and finally verify the results in Altair FICO. Altair WinProp allows engineers to visualize the two principal plane cuts and then interpolate by selecting Convert 2 times 2D to 3D. In the respective dialog box, engineers can choose between five different interpolation algorithms. In this case, we'll choose HPI, the default option, which stands for Horizontal Projection Interpolation. However, engineers are encouraged to use all five algorithms to compare the accuracy. The wizard will ask for a vertical principal plane cut, a horizontal principal plane cut, and a file name for the full 3D radiation pattern. Polarimetric data can then be added to the radiation pattern by selecting Convert to Full Polarimetric. In the dialog box, we'll choose a conversion mode that uses one pattern for both theta and phi polarization. Next, a frequency will be provided, and in this case, it's a Bluetooth frequency of 2.45 GHz. We then select the antenna pattern generated in the previous step before adding a cross-pole discrimination term. Finally, the results can be imported into Altair FICO for verification. Thank you for learning how to convert two principal plane cuts to a full 3D radiation pattern in Altair Hyperworks.